Yeah, you're all right. Just gonna have to take the night off. Mr. Speaker, the Lords who are authorised by Her Majesty's Commission to declare to declare her royal assent to acts passed by both houses and to also declare the prorogation of Parliament desire the presence of this honourable house. Realist? No. 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 you have to say with respect and I recognise that our presence is desired by Her Majesty the Queen's Commissioners. They are doing what they believe to be right and I recognise my role in this matter. Wait a minute. Well, I couldn't care less whether you like it or not. <laughs> No, no, I'm, I'm more than happy if, if people have got the basic tolerance and manners to listen, they'd hear. I'm perfectly happy, as I've advised others, to play my part. Uh, but I do want to make the point that this is not a standard or normal prorogation. It is. I don't require any assistance from you, Mr. Stevenson. You wouldn't have the foggiest idea where to start in seeking to counsel me on this important. I require no response from you. I require no response from you. I require no response from you, young man. I require no response from you. Get out, man. You will not be missed. I was. The point. I had already made the point of people have the manners to listen, which they haven't. The uh, uh, order the that I will play my part. This is not, however, a normal prorogation. It is not typical. It is not standard. It's one of the longest for decades, and it represents not just in the minds of many colleagues, but huge numbers of people outside an active executive fiat. And of executive fiat, and therefore I quite understand. I have already said that Black Rod I respect, and Black Rod is doing her duty, and the Queen's Commissioners are doing their duty, and I will play my part. But I completely understand where I can. It's nothing disorder. I don't require advice on order from you, Mr. Stewart. You are a master of disorder, man. I completely understand why very large numbers of members are much more comfortable staying where they are. Mr Stewart, if you don't like it, you're perfectly entitled to your view. I couldn't give a flying flamingo what your view is. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much indeed. Do your job. Do your job, which you're handsomely paid.